Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I installed this 5x5 lace closure wig from the Dula Hair. This is in their curly texture, and I believe it's like either 22 or 24 inches, and it's 180% density. This wig is just beautiful. You guys know I love the Dula Hair. I always rave about them every time I do a video with their hair. I always tell you guys that they're one of my top favorite companies, and I just never, I've just never been disappointed by them. This wig is just so, 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 so pretty. This is like the perfect summertime wig if you want to like have curly curly hair for like a vacation or something or if you're just in like a curly mood because it's just so full like it's full from the from the top to the bottom like you see that and the curls are just beautiful it's so pretty it's so soft the knots are really nice on it as well i was really really happy to see that the knots were not huge because i hate whenever wigs are like double knotted it's like so hard to bleach them but this wig bleached very easily this wig did bleach very easily the lace was pretty thin it wasn't too thin to where it was like hd lace but it was like that happy medium this is a quick install because it is a five by five so all i had to do was just put down a little bit of glue after i installed it um i went in with my water and with this foam and I just kind of defined the curls in the front because they kind of got a little messed up while I was putting the wig on and I didn't want them to be frizzy looking so I kind of went in with that and defined them a little bit and let it dry and this is just so pretty. I did fully wash this wig when I took it out of the box because I don't like to put wigs on my head straight out of the box. It's just something about um, the chemicals or whatever is put on the hair. It irritates my head and I just... I don't want that on my skin, so I do do a good washing. So I didn't show that part, but I did wash the wig and let it air dry before I put it on. But, and this is what I got. I did not have to do really anything to this hair. Did I say that all I did was bleach the knot on this wig? I did not pluck it at all. I did not cut it at all. Didn't I didn't do any layers. I just wanted to keep it how it came, basically, so you guys can see what you guys will be getting if you did order from the Dula Hair. If you guys are not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button for me. I really appreciate it. Give this video a thumbs up. And if you would like to see how I installed this 5x5 Lace Closure wig from the Dula Hair, then just keep on watching. Thank you.
do that dance, you're nasty, but them nasty. Fix things, quick things, quick things. Well, all right then, can you see me a cleanest? Rose when me rocking at the fucking realest. Chi ching ching, in a dilo with Vibes. Girl one with his PC, he can have real bless. Can I blow a breeze for the head and the penis? Coolest breeze that me rocking a sleeveless. I'm done with the wig. It's like so big and so full. Like, it's like huge. Can y'all see how big this wig is? It's like huge. Oh my god, these curls are so pretty. Look at the curls. So this wig is from the Doula Hair. This is a 5x5 five five closure wig. Um, I don't know if the lace is coming up super dark on camera, but if it is, it's because I spray my lace and spray on it. And I think I might spray a little bit too much, but that's on me. That's not on them. This wig is 180% density, and I believe it's like either 22 or 24 inches. I will have the direct link in the description box for you guys and all of the hair specs so you can know exactly what length this is. But yeah, it just sits kind of like right under my boob, I guess. Just sits kind of right under it. This is so pretty, and the hair is so soft. You guys know that I do love the doula hair, so... There's not really much bad to say about it, but it is five by five also, so I get five inches going back and you get five inches across, which I love. Whenever I do get a closure wig, I like the five by five better than the four by four because I feel like it sits on my head better and it doesn't really like bother my head too much like the four by four closures do. They kind of like irritate my head, kind of. I just think this is so pretty and it's just so soft and so full. This wig will be for sale on my Depop. It's probably already sold by the time this video goes up, but it will be for sale on there i will have my depop linked below for you guys so you guys want to check it out and see um i don't always announce when i post a wig i don't always post it on my instagram i don't always post it on here sometimes you can go on there and i just have a couple wigs for sale so i will have my depop linked below for you guys that's it for the video it was really quick um i didn't do too much to the hair i did not cut it i did not pluck it all i did was bleach the knots it doesn't look like it needed plucking to me all i did was go in with some water and the foam that i always use on my curly wigs just to define it a little bit. All I really did was define the front because I washed this wig and I let it dry. So I didn't really want to mess with the back, but I did want to go in and fix these little pieces in the front because they had got kind of frizzy for me putting the wig on and manipulating it and it kind of lost its curl pattern. That'll be it for this video, you guys. If you're not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it, if you like how this wig turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.